Hey folks, you're all set to check in. This is a quick tutorial on how to use the home theater system. One thing you'll notice in this room, there's a lot of light colors. So I just ask that you not wear any shoes on that light blue carpet. Uh, no sleeping, eating, but especially no drinking out of open containers in this room because stains show up very easily. I do have tumblers in the kitchen. Those are a little safer. Just please be careful. This room is my baby. All right, let's get started. So back there in the corner, you're gonna see a lamp. You don't have to climb back there to turn it on and off. It's done right here. And then cool thing about all of these couches, every one of these backs, if you just lift up and push, they all recline for some great deep couch sitting. Over there is an ottoman with poker chips and board games in it. And then over here, these two switches control the lights. There's front lights and back lights. You can turn them off or cool thing, these little knobs right there control the dimmer setting. So there you go. Just pull them down and they dim. Now onto the remotes. Here in every, and in every room, you're going to find this remote. Controls the TV and the fire stick. Um, if for any reason they don't work in the bedrooms, there's the actual television remote is probably in the drawer beneath the television. So just look for those, be mindful of that. So, the power button right here, it, you should come to this screen right there. That's the home screen, just pressing that home button. And that app right there is for live television. Oh, let me go back to that. That's AT&T TV now. But my family and I, we watch a lot of Prime Video content. There's all kinds of things here. Some of this content does require you to purchase it. Feel free to do so. Just know you can either Venmo me, Apple Pay, Zelle, Cash App, or you could just pay through the, the VRBO. Just reach out to me, however you want to do it, but feel free to, to purchase content. Just make sure you, you pay for it, okay? And then um, right here, this is the remote purely to turn off the projector, that standby button. I ask that whenever you're not using it, please turn the projector off because those lamps have a very short shelf life. And then uh, last thing here is these two remotes. So this is the Blu-ray remote. And then this remote, if you want to use the Blu-ray, you have to press that Blu-ray button. And then when you're done with that, you can go back to the Fire Stick by pressing that Media Player remote. And that's all there is to it. Hope you all enjoy. Call me if you have uh, any questions.